In the last two years, we've learned the basics of football physics. A lot of you have come to me after class with the same reaction. You say, come on, professor, is all you're telling us is that it's better to be a big, fast guy than a slow, small guy? Well, duh. Okay, okay, I hear you. But sometimes, physics isn't quite so obvious. Let's reconsider Newton's third law, the one that says that when two players hit each other, they exert equal forces in opposite directions on the opposing player. But what about a collision between a big offensive guard like Tonio Finotti and a little running back like Corey Ross? Then Newton's law can't hold, can it? It can and it does. No matter how fast one player is moving compared to the other or what their relative weight is, the forces the two players exert on each other is always the same. Even when a big, fast-moving rover cleans out a little running back, the little guy is pushing just as hard as the big guy. The back goes flying because his mass is smaller. But you know, even though I know Newton's third law, I would hate to get in a shoving match with one of these guys.